God's Park, written April 2nd, 2024. In 2017, while living at my parents' house, I felt there was no other place to collect solitude than the small park that acted as my shield. I sat on a bench one morning and drew inspiration from Psalm 13, where I wrote things in my mind like, O oh Lord, where have you gone in the midst of my trouble? I woke up to days of headaches and troubles. Why did you leave me, O oh Lord, in my fears and joblessness? Then I finished these thoughts before standing up. I can't hang on because the alcohol is too strong. And then as I walked through the kindergartner's butterfly sanctuary, I put away my thoughts the same as Mary had before she asked the gardener, where, please, where did they take the body of my Lord? So I put on some song or podcast and let it train me. Helped me try to forget as I made my exit. I'm thinking to myself, there's got to be an end to this at some point. While inhaling and exhaling hot breaths in the most unbearable summer I've ever lived in. Walking down the streets and looked at the store and the coffee house. Counting down the hours until Friday night rolls around and I can drown my worries in Jaeger bombs and Strongbow hard cider. Sing to the walls, then wake the next morning hungover, watching TV for 12 hours straight with my parents. I never fully recover from the trauma of high school, the sting of the divorce, how no publishing house will give me the time of day, and whatever other excuse I can come up with. In these little moments, I keep in my heart the gift, like what Mary did. I will sing in my sober moments to Jesus how he has treated me generously.